What's up guys, Fiery Fortifier here, and today we're playing Bendy and the Ink Machine. So this is a first person puzzle action horror game released on Game Jolt around two weeks ago, and it has simply blown up in popularity. Many people have played it, uh, many people have made videos on it, and as a result, I became very interested. However, I didn't look at any videos so that I could have a fresh experience, and the only thing I learned about this game is that, um, let's see, going off the description, it says that this takes place in the days far past of animation and ends in a very dark future. So this game has to do with early animation. And that's a very interesting premise for a horror game, and I really have no idea what's gonna happen. I know nothing about the plot, so let's just get on with it. Play chapter one. Oh yes, and I forgot to mention, this game is not actually done. Well, this part is done, but this is only chapter one. The second chapter will be released sometime in the future, so, uh, yeah, look out for that. Okay, here we go, guys. Dear Henry, it seems like a lifetime since we worked on cartoons together. Thirty years really slips away, doesn't it? If you're back in town, come visit the old workshop. There's something I need to show you. Your best pal, Joey Drew. Wow. This music is so ominous and creepy. It's crazy. Oh god, look at that friendly guy. Is that gonna be the monster that chases me down the hallways? Oh god, I sure hope not. Chapter 1, Moving Pictures. So, where is this Joey character? And what are these posters? Bendy in Little Devil Darling, presented in Silly Vision. Bendy in Sheep Songs, presented in Silly Vision with Boris the Wolf. And the dancing demon. Whoa. What the heck is Silly Vision? What is this place? It's stylized so well. Okay then, what's what is this? Oh hey there, Bendy. Is that you? Is that the main character of your show? Um Okay, so I don't think I can run. I can just walk around very slowly and I can jump. Okay. So, uh, what's around here? And what the heck is that guy just doing on the wall? That's kind of weird. Dreams come true. And here we see a big splatter of ink. Why is this guy, like, everywhere? He's like a freaking sticker. Um, okay. Let's keep going. Can I open you? Uh, no, I can't. Can I open any of these doors? The ink machine. Oh... That's, uh, some scary. Oh, gosh. Oh, what's this? Can I pick it up? No, I can't. What about you? Nope. Um, whoa. Huh. Donate? What the hell? Yeah, this Joey character must be really messed up. Must have something wrong with him. Uh... Why did the light just turn off? Somebody in there? Okay then. Oh! Uh, that's nice. What the hell? What? The... What the hell is that thing? Jesus Christ! Jesus malarkey! Who's laughing now? Uh, that's, uh, okay, um... Yeah, I think, uh, maybe I should just, uh, run the hell out of here while I still can? Oh my god. Oh. How do I get this to work? Huh. So I have to fix the ink machine. Low pressure. Um, okay, I have to find some objects to please the gods. <gasps> oh, Who put this here? What the hell? Bendy, uh, what do you think you're doing? Are you just popping up behind me like that? Okay, then. Oh, what do we got in here? Some film reels? I can't pick them up. What? Oh, ink pressure. How does any of this work? Uh, 
Okay, then. Where am I supposed to be going? Uh, let me see. Open? Nope, none of these doors open. I wish I could run. That would make things go a little bit faster. Okay, uh, actually, can I pick up- Oh, yes, I can. Okay, so maybe I can put it up on the pedestal? Oh, and I got a gear? Um, so I remember, yeah, there's six pedestals in that room. So I'm guessing I'm- Oh, it automatically put them there. Cool. Okay, so I need to collect four more objects. Oh, and it has them on the walls, I see. I need a wrench. I mean, a, yeah, a wrench, a book, um, a music sheet, and a jar of ink. Alrighty then, let's chop to it. Oh, hey there, Bendy. Looking fine as always. Oh, and actually, wait, wait. I thought I saw an ink bottle. Oh, no, that's just a candle. Um... Okay, then. So, what is this? It just says no. Huh. What's with these posters? The Dancing Demon. That's a pretty weird name. Well, I mean, cartoons in the 1920s were pretty weird, weren't they? Oh, and there's the book. The Illusion of Living. Yeah, this, uh... Guy has a few screws loose, doesn't he? Why don't any of these doors open? Is this guy actually here? So I'm really waiting for the jump scares, like, what's gonna happen? I'm kind of on the edge of my seat. Seriously, is uh, Bendy gonna jump up behind me? Oh, oh yeah, I never really went to this room. Okay, what the hell? This place is so weird. Uh, anything anything at all okay so what do I need again I need a wrench oh shouldn't there be a wrench somewhere around here I also need a music sheet huh and what was the last thing oh why is there a light on in here hello mmm oh somebody's in there and they're up to no good ink bottle anywhere anybody anybody home Oh, there we go. My old desk. Huh. Wasted so much time in this chair. Uh, fond memories. They're probably all gonna be tarnished pretty soon. So now all I need is the music sheet and the wrench. Whoa. Why is this thing making sound now? It's kind of weird. Oh, and I got a, a record. It wasn't really a music sheet, but you know, that's fine. So now all I need is the wrench. Where can I find this particular wrench? Seriously, this bendy guy is so creepy. Looking at me with those weird eyes. What the hell is wrong with that guy? I think he doesn't know what personal space means. Seriously, he's like stalking me. Okay. Mm, where can I find a good old fashioned wrench? So I can offer it to the gods, you know, not so I can actually uh, use it to build something or anything, just so I can offer it to some random god that probably doesn't even exist. Oh, wait a second, guys, look at this. The wrench is inside this guy. Oh my god, what the hell? You better not come alive. Oh lord. Oh my god. Okay, let's go. Oh, I can't pull the switch. It says low pressure. Oh yeah, I need to go to the other room where it said, let the ink flow. It didn't say that, it just said, f ink flow or something along those lines. So, oh god, you know, it's almost like this ink is some sort of blood. Oh, okay, uh, what the f- Hey there, buddy. Wow, you kind of popped out of nowhere. Oh. Okay, things are starting to pick up. Oh, th that doesn't look creepy at all. What a nice, uh, what a nice family-friendly cartoon. Okay, let's let the ink flow. There we go. Okay. What is that sound? Ugh. Okay, let's get back to the switch, guys. And you, I'm watching you. You little bastard. You better not pop out on me. Okay. 
Ugh. Oh. Um. Oh. What was that? A door opened? I don't know what happened. But it's not good. Okay, guys. Ready, main power, with caution. Oh, yes. Let's go. Uh, what the hell is going on? Uh, why is the everything so dark? Um, is this it? Oh, no. I, I don't really want to go. Is this it? Am I supposed to press something? Okay, great. Great, forcing me into the dark hallway. Of course, obviously, nothing bad is going to happen. Or maybe Bendy will pop out and greet me with a friendly smile. Oh, shit. So do I exit? Can I go to the exit now? Uh. Oh. Whoa! Ho, ho, ho. Whoa! Oh, crap! Oh, my God. Is that guy chasing me? Oh, my God, this place is flooding up. Oh, shit, I have to get out of here. Let's go. Exit. Exit. Whoa. Whoa. That was... Insane. Oh, my God. Whoa. The creator lied to us. Um. Where... Where do I need to be going? Oh, here we go, an axe. Clear an old path. Okay then, oh my god. Uh, maybe I can just kill that guy with this axe. Wouldn't that be easy? Seriously. Okay, come on, let's go. Come on. Uh, so, oh! What the hell? And, what, is that it? Oh, come on, things are just getting so cool. End of chapter. Wow. Support chapter 2. www.patreon.com at the meatly. Okay, guys, definitely go support this guy at his Patreon. Because this is the work of a genius. Like, seriously, this is some... This is an amazing game this guy is making. With a... With a um, big enough budget, he could definitely make something awesome. Something terrifying. Bendy will return. Oh gosh, ominous and vague as always. What was that thing that popped up? What the hell? And what was that, like, carcass that had its, like, ribcage showing that kind of looked like, uh, goofy? Oh. Uh, I can't move. What's going on? Oh! Oh, shit! Well then... That was... Amazing! Like, obviously, it did take a little while for things to pick up. The, however, the atmosphere is simply stunning. I was on the edge of my seat for the whole time. And especially when I actually had to start running and the whole place was flooding up. The suspense was so real. I was legitimately scared. So, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed the video, and if so, make sure to blast a like and subscribe button, and leave a comment down below, and as always, I'll see you next time.